All right, I'd like to review a Dr. Janzer case from Einstein Medical. This is a 64-year-old female with two open toe ulcers, Rutherford 5. It is a limb salvage case. This is a de novo lesion right at the takeoff for the perineal, and it is a flush occlusion. Dr. Janzer treated it by going through with a wire and into the perineal and going retrograde back up through a collateral and wiring the PT that way. He also treated during this case the AT with a laser and we're going to look at the results of those two modalities. In this video we're going to note first of all that this is an eccentric lesion. Uh, it's often thought that anything below the knee is going to be a concentric plaque but in this case, it was definitely eccentric, and we're able to identify that with OCT. And because of that, we're able to stay on the plaque, avoiding any vessel wall tissues. And here we're coming up on the media. We can see media and EEL very clearly as we approach those structures. We're going to part off and pack. In the next slide, we can very clearly see vessel wall orient the catheter so that we're cutting only lesion. Notice that the balloon is not inflated because the seven French catheter is large enough to treat the vessel without opposing with the balloon. We're able to take it down. As we start to enter into a little bit of media there, we did cut just a touch of media and then parted off and packed, beginning our next cut. So again, we've identified our structures. We rotate the catheter so that the cutter blade is over disease. Advance, treating the disease segment only. Again, no balloon inflation is necessary in this case. The cutter is up against media, so we stop, part off and back. In the end, we were able to open up the PT very clearly with one pass, taking out that eccentric lesion. I was treated post with a balloon dilatation. If you look at the AT, you can see that the AT is still uh, fairly diseased. The, the flow is not quite as good as what we achieved with Pantheris. And with the data on laser, we can probably expect this patient to be seen back in the, in the near future. With the Pantheris, we had a tremendous safety profile in that we were able to identify vessel wall. We were able to, to identify plaque and target that plaque. We used almost no balloon inflation. We were able to go down with one pass and remove this eccentric disease and identify that it was eccentric. We were able to see the media borders and avoid them. For the most part, we did hit media in one area but did not cut all the way through the media and we were able to avoid adventitia. Uh, we were not able to see this disease uh, distribution under fluoroscopy, so without OCT, we wouldn't have realized that this is what we were treating.